Oh my gosh! Why? 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 Why is everything so expensive in scuba diving? Oh, gee, many Christmas. Well, today, let's find out. So, thought there was an intro there, didn't you? So did I. So, I haven't got one yet. My name is Chris. I'm here to help you learn how to scuba dive, scuba dive, and continue to scuba dive, and save money at the same time. And, lo and behold, first topic is money. Prices. Why is everything so expensive? Do you know where we're going? We're going someplace that nobody's supposed to go. I mean, I mean, we're kind of like astronauts, I mean, honestly. Think about it. If you didn't know how to scuba dive, you would die. If you didn't know how to use the rebreather or the breather or the regulator or the tanks or any of that stuff, you would die. If you didn't know how to if you didn't have the mask on there where you could see, you would die. There you go. That's why. If you didn't have the fins to repulse you against the current, you would die. So, video over, right? Now, I'm here to help you learn how to save money while doing this. So, do you want that guy that says, I can help you learn how to scuba dive for $75? No. No, 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 no. What you want is... <sighs> Gotta do that. I just did that, didn't I? Um... <laughs> talk with my hands trust me I want to be a scuba instructor so apparently this serves what you want there are some things that can't you can't control in prices and neither can the dive operator $185 for patty that is how much it costs to go online and take their course it doesn't matter what course you take now we patty SSI SDI I know I'm hearing everybody go no I can't believe you said that it doesn't matter what course you take as long as you get open water certified but it also doesn't matter what course you take because they control the prices that they require for them to scoop for them to be certified through them what is controlled your dive master dive instructor your class time your pool time your boat time and your open water time and your rental Make sure all of that is up front. And you can do, you get an idea, go to Emerald Coast Scuba's website. They will sh tell you up front what everything is, okay? Um, now that being said, you don't know how you're gonna react, so of course you're gonna get rental gear. While you're there, I don't know over there, but while you're through the going through the course, you're gonna be offered a discounted rate for certain equipment, yay. Yes, you should own your own equipment, and we'll get into that in later videos. Don't worry about buying it so much. Worry about learning how to do your skills. All right? They're going to take breaks, and they're going to do commercial breaks. It's, it's like you're sitting through a big infomercial. It's just you got to get the info between the commercials. Is that right? Anyway, so don't worry about... I know I'm hearing course directors go, Oh, my God, I can't believe he's saying that. And, and you want to learn how to do this sport so when you get underwater you're comfortable you're relaxed you can enjoy this not oh my god I forgot this oh where'd my mouthpiece go zip ties baby trust me there's a reason why they tighten them suckers down but those are incidents and accidents that happen far and few between and you hope you happens in the pool so that way you just bump right up go, oh my god I can't believe I did that and maybe some friends of yours has some video of it so they can embarrass you later. Um, but whenever you get out there in the water and you wonder why you're getting that headache, you want the instructor to explain, hey, look, that is part of uh, DCS. You're in the beginning stages of it. It can happen. It can even happen in the pool. You go up, you go down, you go up, you go down, you go up, you go down, and you do that constantly, you know, in, in, with a tank is different than holding your breath and doing it. And when you go to the courses you'll figure that out now you want that like like I said patty $185 for the coursework and then the rest of it's $350 I think at Emerald Coast for individual I think I spent 700 for my wife and I um, and I can't remember if that included the rental gear or if it didn't and then you just go to the website and find out and you want somebody that's up front with that you don't want somebody that, oh yeah and by the way you're gonna have to spend $65 for the rental gear or you're gonna spend $45 for your BC and $10 for weights. What, excuse me? I dished all this out and that's what I'm here for. I wanna help with that. Why, why am I spending $65 for my very first pair of fins 
And now I have $175 for another set of fins. Well, that's because those fins help me control. Those are great fins for learning and, and, and for, for learning and regular, but whenever I wanted control and do photography, I had to get a different set of fins because they're a lot easier to work with. Um, but that's it. That's why. Why is it so expensive? Because we are going someplace that we are not supposed to go without having something with us. And you want somebody to learn, to teach you, and to care about teaching you, and care about making you like, enjoy, um, and relax. Be relaxed. My instructor, he would not let us go until we looked comfortable in the water. When we looked comfortable in the, when you're comfortable in the water, you can enjoy what's around you, such as that big seven gilled ray that was down to my right that I didn't see because I was like making sure all my stuff was right. And then when we did the second dive, lo and behold, there it was. It hadn't moved because it's asleep. It doesn't care about us. Um, guys, my name is Chris. This is Just Keep Scuba Diving, Scuba Diving on a Budget. Hit the like, hit the subscribe button. I love it. If we get to 100, we're going to do some stuff. There's some stuff, 100, 500, 1,000 I've got planned. I'm thinking maybe at 1,000 subscribers, maybe if my wife agrees to it, we can go diving and maybe I can pay for the diving for you guys, for one of you. Um, I'm not sure yet. The diving, yes. The trip, no. no. I don't know. Anyway, I want to do some stuff. Giveaway. I got stuff to give away back here. Um, please. Hit the like, hit the subscribe button, and I will catch you next time. I think the next time we are going to talk about owning and renting, or owning or renting our gear, which is better, and what do I think about it? Love you. Just keep scuba diving, scuba diving on a budget.